y'all what is up and welcome back to my channel for another part of the sims 2 strange town so this is our second part of this new little sims 2 series in case you missed the first one we introduced the beaker family yeah the beaker family that's right <laughs> and so for the first few videos we are going to be just going around and introducing all of the families in strange town that we are going to be playing with so we're just going to go and order from the beaker all the way across strange town so our next family that we are going to be um, playing or learning about is the grunt family which is probably my favorite family um in strange town so this is the grunt family and their little bio says tank has always lived under the hard thumb of his father general buzz grunt in this domesticated boot camp can tank prove his worth to his demanding dad okay so when we jump into the grunt family it says young tank really wants his father's approval will finding a good job and working hard finally win tank his father's respect use the computer to start the job search all right so let's go one by one through all the family members and do the usual like introductions and whatnot so this is our daddy here daddy grunt this is general buzz grunt um, he is an adult. Um, he's getting near, near elder stage. Well, 15 days, I guess that's not, I mean, that's not terrible, you know, but let's go to his little bio here. And it says, the general likes to have his clock set to military time. He used to enjoy barbership quartet singing, but that is classified information. <laughs> so, he is a Leo, as am I, and he is very fit, so he's obviously very into fitness and everything. Um, there's all of his interests, you know, if you're interested in that. Um, let's see, let's go through his memories and see what we got going on here. So, um, it says he made bet. okay, well, hold up, before we do that, I'm sorry, I'm all over the place, bear with me. I want to go to his family tree so we can see who these people are since we're going through his memories. I need to know, and you need to know who it is we're freaking talking about. So, General Rock Grunt and Wanda Grunt is his great, or not great, Jesus, grandparents. And so his dad is General Chip Grunt. Okay, so Chip is his dad. Missy is his mother. And Mike Steele and Mary Mellons is Missy's mom. Okay, so we've got, all right. Yeah, okay, so I just read Chip. I'm sorry, I'm all over the freaking place. Chip is his uh, dad, okay. So then, if we go to the boys, we'll see that their mother is Lila Grunt, which we'll learn that Lila Grunt is deceased, obviously. So we'll learn a little bit about that as we dig more into Strange Town. But he has sons Tank Grunt, Rip Grunt, and Buck Grunt. Okay, so that'll help me with the memories a little bit. So sorry, bear with me. So he made best friends with his dad. He grew up well. He met Lila. Uh, grew up well. Got in a fight with Pascal and won, got in a fight with Vidkut and won, got in a fight with Loki and won, and got in a fight with Laszlo and won. So apparently he likes to fight and he is not very good friends with the uh, Curious or the Beaker family. He had his very first kiss with Lila, grew up well, fell in love with Lila, got engaged to Lila, got a job, got married got a promotion, uh, his dad died, he woohooed with Lila, got a promotion, had Tank, and his mother died, got a promotion, taught Tank to talk, taught him to walk, uh, had Rip, Tank grew up well, so it's like he's a good dad, he's teaching them their skills, got a promotion, uh, Rip grew up badly, oh, okay, so maybe we'll see that there's kind of like tension between rip and the rest of his brothers maybe because like his dad got so you know involved in his job he kind of didn't teach him you know all the skills he needed so he grew up badly which is sad got two promotions had buck uh he lost a fight with pollination pollination tech nine uh, we'll learn about him later but grew up well he broke up with lila <gasps> i did not know that i, I really didn't i'm this is news to me. He broke up with Lila, got a promotion, Tank grew up well, Rip grew up badly, got a promotion, and reached the top of the military career. So he broke up with Lila, and I do remember that they don't have any recollection of her dying because she apparently did not die on their home lot. She actually died, um, 
on the Spectre lot, which, you know, we'll get to her eventually. All this is going to tie in if you're not familiar with uh, Strange Town. It's, like, very strange, but they're all interconnected, which is why we're going through and talking about them. But, yeah, they have no memory of their mother dying or his wife dying, but apparently he broke up with her before she died, which is really sad. Um, so, what else? His turn-ons... Uh, Oh, that's interesting. Considering that he is very fit, his turn-ons is uh, some thick girls. He's like, he likes some thick. He likes fatness, but he also likes athletic. That makes no sense at all. His turn-offs is glasses. Um, he has reached the top of the military career, so he is a general. He has a lot of mechanical charisma and body skills, so... He's doing pretty good as far as his relationships. He has a decent relationship with Tank, probably the best out of the other sons. Doesn't have a very good relationship with Rip. And, um, I don't know, it looks like Buck doesn't have a very good relationship with his dad either, which is not nice. Uh, Pollination Tech 9 is his enemy. Um, and all of the other Spectre, not Spectre. Oh my gosh, Curious Brothers, he's not too fond of either. And he's also not fond of Olive Spectre, which probably because she killed his wife, that's what I'm guessing. But, you know, we'll, we'll get to all that. So, moving on to Tank Grunt out here. For the longest time, actually, okay. Okay, he is a teenager. I'm so confused. I thought he was a young adult, but he's a teenager. Okay, so, he's, he's about to be a young adult, though. And apparently, he's very into pleasing his father. He wants to be just like his father. I mean, first thing that's got to go, once I play with him, once we get into all that action, we're taking that little mask off because that's just, I don't like that. I just don't. It's not, I mean, come on now. Who walks around wearing that? Nobody. So, I don't even know what I'm trying to do right now. Where is his bio? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, right here. Okay. So, Tank Grunt wants to be just like his old man. He spends his days lifting heavy things, dodging imaginary bullets, and being bigger than the other guy, but deep down inside, he wonders if anyone really knows who he is. Oh, that's really sad. You know, he's trying so hard to be like his dad. Um, he doesn't really know who he is. Um, he's a Capricorn. Um, let's see. His memories include, you know, being potty trained, walking, growing up well. Uh, he met Mystery Sim, Rip grew up badly, Buck grew up badly, grew up well, and Rip grew up badly. Hmm, interesting. So, not a lot of memories. Uh, I wonder who the Mystery Sim is. That's interesting. His turn-ons is athletic, uh, good at cleaning, and his turns-off is glasses. So, he is a public school student. He has an A- minus, and apparently uh, he wants a job. I'm assuming a part-time job to please his father, so we'll work on that as well. Um, his wants, he wants to win a fight with Johnny. Let's go to his relationship. So he is enemies with Johnny Smith. So Johnny Smith, for those of you who are not familiar, we're going to learn, he is the son of Pollination Tech 9. Pollination Tech 9. Tech number 9. Oh my gosh, is that how you say it? <laughs> so that is his son. So his dad doesn't like uh pollination tech nine and he doesn't like johnny so interesting he's friends with his dad but his dad is not friends with him that's really sad and he doesn't have a very good relationship with either of his brothers but yeah he wants to get a job in the military career and get an a plus report card all right so moving on to rip grunt which you know the odd one out is always my favorite, and I've always loved him. He just seems so misunderstood, and, you know, he's in this strict family. He doesn't want anything to do with his life, but, you know, here he is. So, oh my gosh, let's go to his bio. So, it says, Rip totally doesn't care what you think of him. He is going to do whatever he wants to do, which is mostly what everyone else is doing. <laughs> um, and he is a Sagittarius. Um, let's see, his memories include... Uh, being potty trained by Lila, learn to walk from Lila. He did. Okay, I thought he grew up badly because he didn't learn any of his skills. But apparently his mom taught him the skills. Uh, but he still grew up badly. He met Mystery Sim. Tank grew up well. Uh, grew up badly. And he got a job. Who is this Mystery Sim? Who is this Mystery Sim that everybody keeps meeting? I wonder if it's Bella Goth. I don't know. I really don't. Uh, his turn-ons is fitness great cook and he does not like red hair so he is a public school student he doesn't have the best grades he has a c he's not doing very good but he does have a part-time job so he is a gas station attendant and as far as his relationships 
Uh, he is friends with his little brother, not too fond of his dad or Tank. He is friends with Ophelia Nigmas, Nigmos, I think that's how you say it. And he's very close to being friends with Johnny Smith, um, which is disliked by his brother. And it looks like he wants to sneak out with Ophelia. And I know a lot of people, and I have always had him and um, Ophelia end up dating because, I don't know, I feel like I get the vibe that he really likes her. Uh, so, yeah, we'll see how that goes. But that is Rip Grunt. So moving on to little Buck Grunt. Where's he at? Here he is. He's so cute. Um, his little bio says, More than anything else, Buck wants to be a pet stylist to the stars. He spends a lot of time wondering why his father never seems to notice him. Aww. And so he is um, a little bit on the chunky side, which probably doesn't make his dad too happy since he's like very fit and everything but he is the youngest so he doesn't get a lot of attention which usually the babies do get a lot of attention but in Buck's case um he doesn't which is really really sad as far as his memories he just has memories of you know being potty trained and growing up well and his brothers growing up well and uh Rip growing up badly, not a lot in his uh, history here, but he is four days from becoming a teenager, so he wants to win a game against Rip, hug General Buzz, oh, like, you see, he's wanting some attention from his dad, that is really sad, he wants to make a friend, oh, my heart, so we're gonna give him some friends, oh, I love him, okay, so this is their house, which reminds me of, like, a boot camp, which, obviously, I'm pretty sure that's what it's you know modeled after check out my sims 2 to sims 4 series if you want to see me recreate this house <laughs> it was a lot of fun so yeah this is their house and if we go down here let me just go ahead and show you everything show off all of our rooms here all right so obviously we have the little living area when you walk in here which isn't very big it's kind of narrow and we have this um, bedroom down here with the computer, which I always imagined was Tank's bedroom. And then a bathroom right here for downstairs. And then here's the kitchen and the dining room, which reminds me of, like, a cafeteria. <laughs> I don't know why there's two tables, but, I mean, I guess that's because it's supposed to be, like, a boot camp. All right, and if you go upstairs, we have this bedroom right here, which has an ensuite bathroom, which... I have always assumed this was General Buzz Grunt's room just because it has a little ensuite here. And then this is obviously Buck's room because it has a little toy box for him. And then over here, this is Rip's room. You know, he's got his little posters on the wall which complement his personality. They have a bathroom right here that the boys share. And then over here, uh, we have, I guess this is General Buzz and Tank's little workout room. And if you come outside, you see their little course, little military course they can run. And then we have this up here, which just has the, the nice little, you know, telescope that everybody in, uh, in Strange Town has. And then we have the swing set, a little outdoor patio area. So, yeah, this is their house, and that is the Grunt family. So, first things first... Um, okay, it said that we need to get Hank a job, so, um, I think we're gonna do that. Let's just go over here and find a job. <gasps> oh, how rude! Buck just came over here to hug his dad and he got rejected. That is awful. You know what? I really think what General Buzz Grunt needs is a little love in his life. Okay, he lost his wife. He's bitter and he's angry. He broke up with her. I, I need to. I need to get the scoop. I need to do my research. If any of you know, because some of you are like experts on The Sims too, and I really do appreciate all the help. If you know what happened, let me know. What happened? Why did he break up with his wife? And you know, obviously, she ended up passing away. So, anyways, moving on. There is an opening in the military career track as a paintball attendant. Okay, we're definitely going to take that job. So, um, because he wants to be like his dad obviously look at his face uh but first things first i'm gonna come over here and change his appearance because i just i'm not feeling the face paint i just do not think it's realistic at all looks like rip's coming over here to aggravate his older brother just just being a little pest just being rebellious because he can do what he wants to do and nobody can tell him otherwise you know but yeah, I'm definitely going to get rid of that face paint on them. Um, I know some of y'all don't like me to change them up too much, which I don't have custom content. So it's pretty much vanilla styled Sims 2, 
but there's just sometimes you gotta just you gotta change some things and this is one thing that I want to change you know he looks so much better so handsome he's a very handsome handsome little sucker but that face paint had to go same with General Buzz Grunt we're gonna take his off as well I know he's done very good in his career and he he likes that life but I'm not liking the face paint so yeah I really want Hank to find him a girlfriend too um I don't know I've I want to really focus on each of the boys' lives, and obviously, of course, General Buzz Grunt. Oh, sorry, I had to, like, hiccup. I have indigestion, you know. Um, where's the costume paint? Here we are. Yeah, there we go. He See, he looks so much better. Tank looks just like his dad. Very handsome. Very handsome. Okay, much better. Much better. But, yeah, I do obviously want to try to make their lives better, um, and, you know, I really want... <sighs> tank uh, to find out who he is uh, while he is still pursuing, you know, making his father proud. I want him to find out who he is. I want him to find love. I don't want him to be bitter and angry like his dad. Um, I think maybe he notices that his dad is a little harsh and maybe, you know, if he had someone in his life, you know, maybe his mom was still in his life, that they wouldn't be having this issue with their dad being so strict and distant, if that makes sense. So I do want to, you know, hopefully, maybe find General Buzz Grunt true love. Maybe open his heart up a little bit and try to have a better relationship with Rip and Buck and just not favor Tank so much, which just pisses me off. And then as far as Rip, I really want to focus, you know, on him. I know Philia kind of seeing where things go with that and, you know, him just continuing his rebellion. I don't see him changing at all but I do want him to hopefully you know get closer with his dad and his older brother oh oh that was sweet thank you somebody's being nice to Buck Buck's just wanting some attention um uh, because you know I know they don't get along they don't have the same interest but you know realistically anything can happen and he should know that after losing his mom he could and you could lose anybody in the blink of an eye and you don't want to regret that relationship so we're gonna try positivity here trying to make all these relationships better and as far as little buck goes um i don't know we're gonna have to just explore with him and you know see what he wants to do in his life as he grows up hopefully you know he doesn't have to try too hard to get his dad's attention uh, but yeah, so that is the Grunt family. Uh, this part, we're just introducing them, so I'm not really sure how long this is. Uh, but I'm not going to really uh, play much um, with them right now, just because, you know, like I said, I'm sticking to the introductions and everything. Oh, that's going to bother me. Oh, I don't like that. That looks very dangerous. Hold up, I need to give them a... How do you do this? I don't remember how to build. How do you build? Okay, we need to add a stair... There we go. That's dangerous. <laughs> um, there, I fixed that. But yeah, anyways, I'm all over the place. I hope you guys are still with me. <laughs> this is the Grunt family, and I'm going to end this part here because, like I said, I'm just introducing them. I want to know what you've done with the Grunt family and your gameplay, you know, when you used to play The Sims 2. Let me know any secrets on the family that I am not familiar with. I really need to dig in and do a little bit more research on my own it's been a hot minute since i've you know caught up on the sims 2 gossip and drama but yeah let me know what y'all think about the grunt family what you want to see with this family um and yeah with that being said i'm gonna go now thank you guys so much for watching give this video a big thumbs up if you like it if you're looking forward to you know getting to know the rest of the strange channel families in this let's play love you guys so much and i will talk to y'all later bye